Here's a quick tip for using Logic's stock gate plugin to add interest to a keyboard part. We're going to use a hi-hat track to trigger the noise gate to make a new pattern for a sustained keyboard pad. I've already duplicated the hi-hat track and named this track Hat Trigger. Let's insert the stock Logic noise gate on the main pad track. This gate lets you assign a trigger called a sidechain signal. Let's select our hat trigger as our sidechain input. We can immediately hear that the pad is controlled by the hat trigger rhythm. Now we can adjust the parameters of the gate to dial in the best effect. So you can see, gates can be used to create interesting and creative musical effects. Be sure to rewatch or pause this video to catch anything you might have missed.